All right, guys, we're gonna have a new way of modifying the pull-ups for the beginners. So instead of hanging the band on the top of the bar like we have in the past, we're gonna hook the band up here on the rack. And as you can see, you just wanna make sure when you hook it up that the deals are um, coming out the right way so they don't flip back. So um, I happen to have two of the same hooks, so I had to put that one on the back of the rack. Chris is gonna show how to get up into this band and we always want to tell our new people in the beginning because we're not really sure um, when we're first trying this out with them if they're going to be able to make it up over the pull-up bar get their chin over the bar so just always let them know like hey our our intention isn't for you to actually get your chin over the bar today but we're going to work towards it so go ahead and step into the band <clears throat> make sure that you always tell them to put their thumb around the bar just for safety purposes and you're going to pull up as far as you can and if it's just halfway, you're gonna hold for three seconds and then lower down for three. Good, and we're gonna do that for however many reps is prescribed. And then over time, um, they're gonna get stronger and be able to pull, pull up even more. If you have somebody that is um, heavier, you can always take this band. Um, you can take the J hooks here and you can just set them a little bit higher. Please try and use bands that are thicker like this purple one, just so they don't snap. Um, the green bands over here are mostly used for mobility stuff, so we just don't want to break those. Uh, Chris, do you have anything to add to this? Um, nope, not really. <laughs> we covered it all. <laughs> all right, so yeah, go ahead and let's start using this with our beginners. Um, it's just going to be easier to set it up. The coach won't, be have, won't have to be quite as involved in helping them strap into the bands, and I think it's going to be um, just easier to run a class this way. They can do this in the strength session. And they can um, probably just stay in the strength session. I'm not sure in the wads. If they can't get their chin over the bar, it probably is um, best to just keep them at, at ring rows or jumping pull-ups for now. Um, but if they're pretty close and they just need a little bit of assistance and they're getting their chin over the bar, they can probably use it in a workout. We're going to leave some of these bands set up on the racks over the next few weeks just to remind you guys to use this as a substitution. Thank you. <laughs>